Hi everyone, welcome to Jacob the Analyst YouTube channel. Today I have to talk about three outstanding athletes. We have Masai Russell, a former graduate of Kentucky who just got done running the 60 meter indoor hurdles and boy, it was a lot. Then we have superstar Grant Holloway and lastly, one surprise from a high school sophomore. What do these athletes have in common other than being really, really fast? Well, they happen to have ties to my hometown of the DMV area. Let's get started. This video is brought to you from The Family Shield. We specialize in offering retirement plans, including 401k and Roth rollovers to annuities. For more information, click on the link in the description below. Masai Russell is steadily improving as the season progresses. Started the beginning of the season with a 8.09 in the 60 meter hurdles and improved to 781 taking fourth place in the World Athletics Indoor Championships. She is on track to make amazing strides this season and into the 2024 Olympics based on how she is currently performing. Her top 10 best personal times took place in 2023, qualified in the 2023 Worlds but unable to advance past the second heat. Only 23 years old and the future is looking bright for the young lady. To geek out a little, just a little tiny bit, her 60 meter indoor races have a standard deviation of 0.0 which at least says she's consistent with a negative slope of 0.02 that tells us she's improving in each and every race. And for pro athletes, the challenge comes after college where there are less disciplinary requirements. So whatever Russell is doing, hey, it's absolutely working. But the consistency is not over because Grant Holloway continues to kill it and stay on fire in both the 60 meter hurdles and the 110. Four of his top 10 personal best times have already taken place this year. We're just getting started with the outdoor season. This is absolutely crazy. I see another international repeat of a gold medal in Paris. The odds are so high in his favor, but close contenders nearby include Parchment of Jamaica and Daniel Roberts of the United States. But you guys know who my favorite is, and I, at least, I'm sticking to the US. Which brings me to the last fellow of our wonderful country, and that is Quincy Wilson of Bullis High School, who broke the 400 meter record with a time of 4571. Wow, I am not making this up, and that time is so stupid, which would have put him in the top five at the NCAA Indoor Championships. Right now, I would compare Wilson to the high school version of LeBron James. If he is able to keep this up for the next two years while still in high school, that would go beyond LeBron level. I would not know how or what to compare that level of athleticism to, at least for someone of such a young age. If you guys can think of something, just let me know. And just a side note, his team also broke the high school 4x400 meter indoor record with a time of 3.11. <laughs> That is insane. This is probably why I have not been back to the DMV area in over five years. You do not want that smoke at all. I'm good over here in DFW. Have a great day. So if you liked this video, then check out the videos right above or visit our short clip playlist. Have a great day.